Hello, this is Bern, and if you've ever wondered what is the shortest and quickest way to get out of a painful love dilemma, you're in luck because that's what you and I will be discussing today. Hello, this is Bern. Welcome to your great life too.com. Today is another edition of Get the Love You Crave, and today we're going to be talking about how to get out of a painful love situation in a very quick amount of time. And this is how it came about. I received an email yesterday, much like I do every day in my life, where I get amazing women from all over the planet sending me questions on love. And this question went something like this. She was asking me something along the lines of, how can I become, uh, how can I make him leave her, basically? Like, he's, she's in love with someone who is in a relationship with somebody else, and she wants to find out what is the quickest and best way to get him to love her more than the other woman, basically. So it got me thinking two things. Number one, this is an incredibly courageous woman because she's asking something that although many women would actually judge her for asking this, she has the guts to ask something that a lot of women would, wouldn't. So just for that, she has all my respect. But the second thing it got me thinking is that many times in love, the reason why you're in a painful love dilemma, love situation, is because you're asking the wrong question. The question here is how can I make him leave her for me, what the real question needs to be, how can I create so much aliveness and worth in my life that it doesn't matter if he doesn't leave her because I can connect to someone who does love me for who I am? Or maybe a question such as, how can I create the value and the worth so strongly in my existence right now that every human being I connect with has that feeling of, wow, I want to connect with this human being more. Because if you ask that question, you get a better quality answer. When you ask a poor, poor quality question, you get stuck in a dilemma that's painful to get out of. So my, to make this very simple and non-hypothetical, non-abstract for you today, I want to give you a very specific challenge, which is I want you to come up with the worst question. If you are single, I have no doubt in my mind that you're asking some questions that leave you to be single, right? So I want you to figure out for you, what is the worst question you ask about your love life? And I want you to come up with a much better alternative that puts you in a position of taking action, puts you in a position to finding your worth, connecting to your awesomeness, or gets you in touch with human beings who can help you along the way. That's pretty much what my message for you is today. If you are in a painful love situation, change this around quickly by asking a better question that puts you in power. That's pretty much what I have for you today. If you like this video, simply subscribe on the link below to my free video series. Click on the, if you're watching me on YouTube, click on like and subscribe. Also, I have one more opportunity for someone who wants to connect with me one-on-one -on -one this year and work with me before I start uh, with my group program next year. If you still want to connect one-on-one -on -one with me this year, one slot is open. Click on the link below and you can actually uh, apply for a call. Thank you so much for allowing me to share this with you. As always, I challenge you to live a full and a conscious life.